Welcome to the National Real Estate Cafe. <laughs> All right. Easy hopefully. there. Make sure we don't really fall back. Huh? <laughs> All right. Well, we're doing that. Why? Fall back. From, what's that hour take? Did you really feel like you got an extra hour? It doesn't really help that much. I still, I woke up at like 5.30 in the morning because of that. Actually, I did the opposite. I went to bed after a long weekend and I'm like, getting to bed, okay time. And all of a sudden I realized, I didn't change my clock back. I just gained an hour. It's amazing. Oh, you when really you're, gained an hour. I did yeah. gain an hour because I thought I was going to bed at this time. And I came back, I'm like, oh, that hour it makes it beautiful. I went to bed early. All right, well, let's see what other differences an hour makes, Don. Okay. So let's go to the first slide, Mr. Furman. All right, what difference does an hour make? So daylight savings time. How about this? Can you believe that 633 homes sell every hour? That's pretty amazing. Look at 253 regain positive equity. That's an exciting number for a lot of folks. That means equity. That means net worth and all that good stuff. All right, so if an hour is 633, we have this issue. All right, so during the holidays, we warn everybody that, hey, if we sell so many per hour, well, we lose certain days because of the holidays. Not this a bad thing. Holidays are great, but it hurts our industry because we're going to lose, what, three days? Three days. We lose Veterans Day. We lose Thanksgiving Day. We lose the 25th. And not to mention, we lose half the 23rd, most likely, as well. Yeah, and uh, everybody checking out. So what does that mean? Look at this next slide. Kind of fun. Yeah, vacations affect productivity. So believe it or not, we project that numbers will be a little less for two reasons in November. One, of course, we're losing three days, but we always lose three days. But that, to you, just so you know, that's over 15,000 less sold homes losing that three days. That's unbelievable. And you know what? Even with this, because this happens every year in November, this, right. this month's a little, uh, this time it's a little especially bad. Even with this, we project that this November's numbers will still be better than last November's Way, numbers. Way, because last year we had TRID, which was a regulation issue that we had to deal with with our industry that hurt us and we lost three to who knows how many days? 10 days, I swear. TRID is an acronym for the reason I drink. <laughs> <laughs> Bottom line, it was a new regulation. It's supposed to help the consumer. I think it confused them more, as usual. But you heard it right here on the National Real Estate Cafe, so we don't confuse you. That's right. So check out the website, nrecafe.com, or text, if you like that, to NREC to the number 58885.